at the National Snowcross races in Canada, races in Canterbury. I'm going to go talk to some of the sport riders, including sport women, juniors, and even some of the 120s and see how their day has been going. I'm going to catch up with one of our sport women riders on the circuit. Her name is Stephanie Schmidt. How's your day been going so far? Pretty good. I got a third and I got um, another heat coming up in a final right after that. So what are you looking forward to by finals? Are you thinking you're going to be able to podium out here? Yeah, I podiumed every national race in Duluth. I got third and, or yeah, third in Duluth and I got first at Ironwood. Um, me and Sammy Tarnowski are tied for women's national points right now, first in points. So um, I think it's going to be a good season and a good race. Well, I wish you luck out there. Hope to see you on the podium. All right, thank you. I am here with Sam Tarnowski. She is one of the top sport women riders in our circuit. How is your day going so far? Um, it's going pretty good. Went out there and won my first heat, so we're going to go out there and try again for my next one. Now, you are leading points, correct? Correct. What are you hoping to finish this season? Um, I'm trying for the championship this year. Now, how many years have you been racing snowmobiles? This is my seventh year. So you're a pretty big veteran in this sport. So, with how many years that you've been racing, is this one of your favorite tracks, or do you have some other tracks that you really like a lot better? Um, this is my first time actually coming here, first year doing all nationals, and it's a pretty nice track. I am liking it. <laughs> so do you ever race against the guys out here? Um, not in the national circuit. Back home in the regional circuit, I do. Well, that's pretty good. Keep kicking some boy butt. I am here with James Johnstad, younger brother of Andrew Johnstad. I see you out there, and you are very fast. How is your weekend going so far? Good. So far, I won my both heat races in the junior 14, 15, and 16, 17. So how are you doing in points so far this season? I'm leading both points classes. So you're hoping to hold on to that? Hopefully. So how do you like the track out here? Is it pretty technical or one of your favorite tracks? I like the track a lot. Um, I kind of like a lot of technical tracks, flat tracks. I like any kind of track, actually. All right, well, good luck. Thank you. I am standing in the place called Tech. When the racers pull off the track after their heat is completed, they come to where I am. We Tech, the top three racers of every class, to make sure they're not cheating. I'll just stand here and look good. <laughs> So, I'm out here hanging out with these tech guys. What do you do out here? <laughs> what we do is we, when the racers get done with their race, they come through here, and Bob and I are the ones that make sure that, uh, that the sleds are, are put together right, if you will, that there's no cheating going on. So, what happens if you find someone that's cheating? Uh, they get tossed out. If, if we can confirm that beyond a shadow of a doubt, they're doing something that's not legal, they will be disqualified. So how hard is it to stand out here all day and tech people? Actually, it's kind of boring. We're down here all by ourselves. The only people that we see are the racers that come through all the time. But it's a lot of fun because we have a lot of fun with the teams and the racers. So what's your favorite part about being down here? Uh, probably working with the teams and the racers. There are, we, Tom and I have both been doing this for many, many years and have known most of these guys for, for a long time. And it's just fun interacting with them and kind of putting a fear of God into them once in a while, but it's just fun being with the people. And I've made their day hanging out down here. Yep. <laughs> I am with Nick Patton, Zach Patton's younger brother. Zach Patton is a pro racer on our circuit. You just won a qualifying heat for junior 14, 15. Yep. How did it go for you out there? Good. The track was pretty nice because they just groomed it, but I had a good hole shot and just stay up front. So how's the competition among the junior riders? Yeah, there's a lot of fast kids there, so I have to try my hardest. Who are some of your main sponsors that allowed you to be out here today? Stud Boy, my mom and dad, HMK, ODI Grips, and that's all. So what's it like to have to see your, your older brother out there running the pro class? Is that pretty exciting? Yeah, I hope I can race with him one day, too. Good luck the rest of the weekend. Okay, All right, I'm with Dusty Miller here. He just won his last four qualifying heat. How is the track out there? Pretty rough. I already got knocked out once today. That's exciting. How are you feeling? Uh, my head is ringing and my jaw is pretty sore, so otherwise it's been pretty good. Well, you can't use that as an excuse. You just won your heat. Well, Who are your sponsors? Um, Mom and dad, mainly. My girlfriend and ODI. Bubbles and Bowls, Bishop's Performance, and everyone else. So does that girlfriend help pay for a lot of stuff? Yeah, she bought my shocks for my sled, so. You got a good girlfriend. Well, I well, do. <laughs> well, good luck. We'll see you on the podium. I'm with Cody Thompson. He just won his last qualifying heat. 
You have been fast all weekend. How is this track working for you? It's really good. Uh, I'm finding a lot of good lines out there. You know, I think all the people that are helping me out, Artie Cat, Speedworks, APP Lubricants, all the guys back at the shop, you know, just finding great lines is what you got to do out there and be smooth and ride smart. What is the competition like out there for you? Uh, you know, a lot of the guys are still fast. It's just, uh, I think that with this Artie Cat snowmobile, I'm finding good lines and being smooth and that's the ticket right now is just find a really nice line and being smart. Now you're in the main, what are you looking forward to? Uh, you know, I'd like to win it, but I can't expect to because anything can happen and just gotta make the best of what you got. And that's racing, good luck. Thank you.